I realize that many of the protesters, uh, you know, wanting to defund the police are socialist, Marxist, communist. That's not me. I'm a conservative, which means I'm always for defunding any government institution. And the police would be at the top of the list. So I'm all in. Let me give you five ways that you can do this without tearing down the country. <laughs> Number one. Unions get rid entirely of the police union. I don't think unions should represent government employees at all anyway, but that's another issue. That's the reason you can't fire these people. Think about tenure for teachers. You can have an awful teacher, terrible for the kids. Good luck trying to get rid of that person if they have tenure. Secondly, and by the way, Derek Chauvin, the guy that killed George Floyd, he had multiple, many complaints for police brutality. Listen, if there was a single one of these where he was found guilty, he should have been fired immediately. But of course, he couldn't because of whatever union rules that there were. And speaking of brutality, we need to get rid of all the Rambos in the police department. And I love Rambo, okay? But Rambo is for the military, not the police. Police are public servants. It's a different deal. Better psychological testing and also get rid of them when uh, complaints come in that shows they're going you know, over the line. Thirdly, the big one for me is quit using the police as a revenue generator for the cities. Ah, Listen, before I escaped Chicago, here are the last few tickets I had. None, by the way, for speeding, reckless driving, DUI, that kind of stuff. I had it for not coming to a complete stop at a stop sign. Wearing headphones. Yeah, that's a law in Illinois. Uh, several red light camera tickets. Um, not wearing my seatbelt. But my favorite, I bought a brand new Nissan pickup once. And I was driving down Lakeshore Drive. Loved it. Little bitty truck. Uh, Lakeshore Drive is that gorgeous drive between Lake Michigan and the skyline of Chicago. All of a sudden, the lights come on and I'm pulled over. And the cop says, hey, do you realize you can't drive a truck on Lakeshore? And I'm like, no, why is that? He's like, are you resisting arrest? Well, no. So I had to research on my own, found out Chicago had passed a law back in 1950s that said business trucks couldn't travel on Lakeshore. And I get that, but I wasn't carrying a load of cabbage. It wasn't for business, but it didn't matter. It was all about the 150 bucks that, that I had to pay. Fourth, demilitarize the police. They are not the military. Suburb I lived in had a SWAT team, all this equipment. And in the 20 years I lived there, I don't think they ever were called out. I mean, I could go through the list. It's just insane. And lastly, maybe most importantly, if you're one of these people that's for doing away with the police department, best idea yet. Ready? Stop calling them. Never dial 911 again, or even just call the police department for any reason. Take care of your own crap, and the police will be gone.